Stay away from alcohol, kids. Leave it all for me. Leave it all for me. Oh my god, yo, yo, Turnstile is so amazing, what? This music gets you so pumped. It makes me feel like a kid again, it makes me feel like I'm back in like the fifth grade listening to music from my PSP playing ATV or... Y'all know what I'm talking about, y'all know what I'm talking about. I've been listening to rock and punk music since I was in literally middle school and to hear music like this in 2021 is just mind-blowing to me it's ridiculous but what's crazy rock has been dead for a while but then here comes turnstile to like revitalize the genre and put their own little spin to it i love it it's just it just sounds so great but nah shout out to blood orange their song together is like it's so beautiful Anyway guys, today we are here to talk about this amazing band that I found about three weeks ago and their name is Turnstile. I know this is not something I usually talk about rock music, what? but it's an enigma. What do you expect? It's an enigma. Anyway y'all, y'all ready? Let's go. Formed in Baltimore, Maryland. Wait, they from Baltimore? <laughs> That's why they're yelling. Yo, imagine the members of this band has like that that Baltimore accent, that British. I, I can't do it, but it's it's hilarious. <laughs> the Baltimore accent is like the funniest thing ever. People are chewing on the fuck with you, monocular. Oh, you look like a ooze now, but jiggle a fuck with my neck. Hey, I'll be sitting right there. Why not? Because somebody is sitting right here and it's not going to be you. Turnstile released their first EP in 2011 and it was titled Pressure to Succeed. Yeah, the pressure to escape Baltimore. Now, nah, let me stop before some money bus more, pull up with a chariot, and run me over. My outlook on music has always kind of been very broad and open, letting genres and expectations to kind of be blurred and washed out a little bit. Our band is just a one giant person. Oh, we're all just connected. <laughs> that's it, that's it. Turnstile is six of us in the band together. That's it. And that's it. What's funny is that initially Turnstile started out as an excuse for the members to just chill with each other because they're all best friends. Brendan, lead vocalist, Brady, lead guitarist, Daniel, who's on drums, and Franz, who's on bass, cultivated five EPs and two studio albums together, but they're more known for the chaos that happens at their shows. Now, why can't I be there, yo? Damn. One thing you guys need to understand, my enigmas, is that mosh pitting is one of the most fun things that you could possibly do, like, ever. I know it just looked like people frailing around, hitting each other, smacking each other, but all it is is just people having a good time, enjoying themselves to something that they enjoy together. And after a mosh pit, you just feel like a sense of relaxation. Like, when you leave a mosh pit, all your stress, all your problems, all your anxiety and whatever is just washed away because you already got it all out in the in the mosh pit so you just leave feeling so rejuvenated and it's it's a great feeling if you guys haven't experienced it yet of course you can't do it right now but back then like you guys i don't know what i'm saying but it's a good time it's a really good time all right enough of that let's get back on topic now, I won't sit here and say I listened to their entire discography, but from what I did hear, this band is pure fun. The album time and space is absolutely heavy throughout. My only gripe with this short project is that I wish there were more melodic moments. Other than that, this album is perfect. Wow. 
Did I mention that Generator is like my favorite turnstile song? When I first heard Generator, I was like, what the hell is this? This is amazing. The first half. And then the second half came and just blew me away. I was like, whoa. If you guys didn't know, there's like a house, there's a house version to this song, and it's just, come on. Turnstile will be dropping another album titled Glow On, the 27th of August. If I was to make a prediction, I believe this album is going to be as chaotic as Time and Space, but also have more melody. Some of you are probably like, hell no, I want more chaos and hey, to each his own. Overall, I absolutely love what this band is doing. Their sound is so fresh and I absolutely love the fact that they're not following a trend and they're just doing what they love because you could really hear it in their music. Turnstile said in an interview that they make music for people to have fun and express themselves and I think that's completely true because I haven't had this much fun listening to music in a long time. And that is all. I have for you guys today. This has been Romario from An Enigma. I know you guys are waiting for that Isaiah Rashad video. I know, I know. It's coming. It's coming. I'm gonna do Isaiah Rashad next and then I'll get this channel back on schedule. I say that all the time, but <laughs> your boy got a job. Your boy working. Your boy working. Your boy working. Okay? So I don't have time, but nah, that's cap. I got time. Also, even if you're not into punk rock or music like this just give them a try just give them a chance you'll find a song you like stop being a hard ass just this don't wait for things to get big to embrace it just do it now so that when it gets big you could be like i was on that before it got big you feel me you'll feel cooler that way trust me i anyway y'all i'm chatting this has been romario from an enigma and I want you guys to stay different, all right? Peace. The inner machinations of my mind are an enigma. Yeah, I thought I was drinking alcohol. I ain't drinking no damn alcohol. I'm drinking some salsa water. Look at this salsa water. It's called watermelon. Watermelon. No, it's kind of not called watermelon. It's called um Waterloo. 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 <laughs> what am I doing? Ah. Disgusting. Grapefruit. Ugh, nasty.